we're going to make a try to make a bubble flare with a double flare tool. Here I've got the flare tool clamped to a piece of 2x4 just to help hold it. I'm going to put the end up through, clamp it down, but I want it to be a little sticking up a little less than a quarter of an inch to get the best result. Okay. The end has to be cut clean and be straight. Now I'm using the flat side of the flaring bar, not the side with the recession in it for that you would use to make a flare or a double flare. So I put my arbor in just as if I was going to start making a double flare. Get it in there, make sure that everything is straight and even. And then I just start turning it. And when you're doing this on the car, that's why I have it clamped down to this 2x4 because it really helps by keeping the flare tool from moving all over the place. Once you really wind on this, and you need to clamp this down pretty hard to replicate the bubble flare just to really squish it down. And it looks pretty good. So now, open it back up. Don't lose your arbor. And what you end up with is something that uh, looks pretty much identical to your regular bubble flare that came on this car. That's all there is to it.